Hey, what's up, my fellow zombie players? It's iBad Man. Today, I got something special on the zombie channel. Um, I'm gonna be talking about Moon and my basically my predictions, what I think is gonna happen in Moon. Um, just basically what's going down. All right, the first thing I want to talk about is the new gun that I saw, the two new guns that I saw in the trailer. And by the way, the gameplay in the background is gonna be some random gameplay that I found um, on my hard drive of zombies it might not be amazing um, but stay tuned for some really cool quad life stuff on the zombie channel um, to all the new subscribers that have come over from the machinima video I've done um, alright first thing I want to talk about is this dual wielding gun um, what a lot of people are throwing around is that it is the dual wielding wonder waffles and that is crazy um, to think that they'll bring in dual wielding wonder waffle because that that just seems super overpowered because it seems like you're going to be much more mobile um because uh for uh, uh bleh, dual wielding guns make you a lot more mobile um because uh, they're more lightweight and the next thing is you're going to have a lot more ammo because the wonder waffle would shoot a certain amount and then have to reload it seems like this gun will have you know like you can empty one out while you're reloading that one empty out the other one so it seems like if it's dual wielding wonder waffles that's just going to be crazy um I don't know like what they'll do if you pack a punch that type of gun. I don't know. Um, I haven't even seen the pack a punch. I was I was skimming through the trailer, um, and I didn't even see the pack a punch. Uh, the next gun is a really big looking awesome gun that basically stops the zombies and blows them up from the inside out. It bloats them up and they just explode. Um, you know it looks crazy. Uh, it's I don't know if it's gonna have sort of splash damage since if it blows up it'll do a splash damage and affect other zombies around it. That I do not know. Um, the next thing is uh, you see Deadshot in one of the images in the video, so guaranteed uh, Deadshot's gonna be there. Or um, it's the new perk they introduced in Call of the Dead, um, the one that I never get. <laughs> um, I don't know if they're gonna introduce any perks. You didn't see any new perk machines in the game, but it's. I'm hoping they introduce some sort of um, perk that will affect the the gravity, because that'd be cool. Because like they said in the trailer, gravity is gonna be such an important thing, and sound is also gonna be an important thing. Because since you're on the moon, gravity is pulling you in different directions. You're a lot lighter, so you might miss turns. And if there's a perk that can affect your gravity, that would be amazing. Because then, you know, that would incentivize people, incentivize people, I'm using big words here, um, people to go get that perk um, and be able to run normally, you know, because if not, it's going to be a lot harder to be jumping in midair, trying to turn around this corner to get in your cycle around the map and just be completely screwed over because you over hit the jump and now you're stuck in a corner and you have hundreds of zombies piling on top of you. So... That's something to think about. I don't know if they're going to do that, if there is a new perk, if there isn't. Um, they're saying that they're mixing in a bunch of elements from all the zombie maps. So there's going to be outside, underground, like in Shangri-La, outside, like in Shinonuma. Uh, 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 especially, of course, it's on the moon, though, not in a swamp like Shinonuma is. Um, and then there's this one particular part in the trailer that really got, got me confused. Um, it's when he's using the dual-wielding Colts. And he's shooting a zombie coming at him. It seems like he's not on the moon. Which is flipping me out. Uh, as you guys know, Shangri-La has an Easter egg that turns it from day to night. Um, there might be an Easter egg in this map that takes you from the moon to somewhere else. Um, and I've been seeing some videos on people predicting it's Area 51. You go from the moon to Area 51. And as everyone knows, Hangar 18 is Area 51. And... Um, there's a lot of similarities between Hangar 18 and the um, that location in the actual trailer. There's a yellow tarp in the background. Um, the color of the buildings are similar to the ones in Hangar 18. Um, it's very bright outside, and Hangar 18 is a bright map as well. It's really sunny. Um, there's space suits in Hangar 18, and I know that's for the Blackbirds because they go into high altitudes, the Blackbirds. Um, they, they, they're meant to be very high in the sky, so people need to wear spacesuits when riding Blackbirds. But, you know, that's also something they have in the moon level that is in the map Hangar 18. So there's just a bunch of similarities there. Um, next thing they said, of course, sound will be affected since you're on the moon. Sound is 
portrayed differently through someone's ears. It's going to be silent, I think, supposedly, or, like, much lower the, the silence, and you, it'll be harder to hear the zombies. I don't know how that's going to work. Um, I've never been to the moon. Don't know how the moon works in real life, so can't really tell you about that. I can't wait to try it out. In general, I'm super pumped. I can't wait to see how they're going to end this or how they're going to end basically Black Ops Zombies. Um, if there's going to be zombies in the next generation, I don't know. But how they're going to end the zombies of this gen Black Ops. And it seems like they're going to end it with a massive bang. And there's some small part at the end which really got me confused. At the end, 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 end of the trailer, um, they flash a symbol and then a uh, Nova 6 zombie screaming which isn't that weird but the thing is the Nova 6 zombie oh, yeah. isn't in the game it's a real zombie like real life like they made it like a real person dressed up as a thing so I don't know if that's incentivizing a Call of Duty Black Ops zombie movie based off the, the maps that'll be crazy or based off the story because there's a really in-depth story in Call of Duty Black Ops um, go check that out check out the trailer I'll put an an annotation or somewhere linked in the description because I have it uploaded on the main channel. But check it out because at the end, 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 like in the last second, there's a, just a, uh, a Nova 6 zombie screeching, cr screaming. Pause the video when you see it. Um, and it's a realistic zombie. It's not a in-game Nova 6 zombie, which is understandable if it's in-game. This is a real thing. And then there's a logo that's flashing um, that does have a symbol similar to something from Hangar 18 also, which could be symbolizing that the Easter egg takes you to Area 51, from the moon to Area 51, which would be awesome. Um, in general, I'm super pumped. Hope you guys enjoyed it. If you guys can please leave a like rating, a comment, a favorite, spread this around um, so we can get a nice... Uh, pot stirring up in the comment section below and if you guys really like the video and want to see a lot of zombie content Subscribe to this channel because this is the dedicated zombie channel of I bad Matt and uh, My friends and family I post stuff here with my dad like left for dead zombies, which is awesome and a whole bunch of other stuff All right guys, so uh, peace out and stay tuned for a lot more. I love you guys All right, bye